Slow is smooth, smooth is fast. Like the sloth add on there, we start at the Ohio State Golf Club, and that is Grant Lease for Ottoville. He would bogey here and finish with a 91. Then Ottoville's Michael Turnwald, five shot here. He finishes with an 88 on day one. Then Carter Schnipke, also boating, well, also with a bogey rather, 82. Big green tied for eighth after day one. To Kaleida on the 10th, Connor Nardker with the bogey, but he finished with 84 on the day. Same hole, Ryan Clossing pars out. Knocks that down, finishes with an 81. Wildcats in sixth place as a team after day one. Back over to the first, Botkins Jack Dietz pars and has an 81 on the day. Then Jamison Meyer also knocking down the ball in four. He would finish with an 85. Botkins in fourth place overall. Now Mr. in action at the 10th, Mitchell Bourne Horace Bogies. He finishes with an 87. Then Jack Meyer. Seventh shot is good at this hole. He would finish overall with a 91. Also finishing with a 91, Nathan Beer. As he hits a bogey on that hole. And then Lewis Magoto with a seven on that. He would also finish with a 91. Individuals, Zach Miller from Allen East. Check out this long putt opportunity for birdie and absolutely drills it. Had an eagle later on on four and finished two over for the day. Second overall in the state right now. Zach Miller with a chance at a state title tomorrow. Joining him in the top 10, Delphi St. John's Jack Gerker parring out on 10 here as he finishes, knocks that one down. He's had a 76 on the day. Luke Rosebrock for Archbold, knocking down the par, finishing with an 83. Heading on to Division Two now, Britton Hall and Coach Magellette trying to navigate the 12th at North Star Golf Club. And this one was difficult. Here's why Wayne Dale's Deegan B with the putt. And that's gonna roll all the way back. The green is difficult to read as ancient Greek for a lot of the putters here. So Hall taking his opportunity on it. This is his third putt and gets the lip and then gets it to drop back in. He would finish with a bogey here and good for sixth place overall. He finishes three over for day one. Over on the ninth, Bryce McDaniel of Liberty Benton finishing nine over, including this six on the ninth hole, shot 81 for the day. Brian in D2 in third place after day one as well, but trailing first place, Archbishop Alter by 40 strokes, gonna be very difficult to catch them. 